Hey everyone, it's Joni Hollifield, your leadership coach. So check this out. I was speaking with the client and what this lady said to me almost made me fall out. She said, Joni, what's the problem? My employees don't need to like me, they just need to respect me. This bothered me on many different levels and I'm going to break this down to you guys really quick so that you can understand why it's important for your employees to like you. So if you've ever heard someone say they don't need to like me, they just need to respect me, I want you to hit pause right now, drag that person over to your computer, desktop, cell phone, whatever you're watching this on and tell them to sit down and listen. This is why your employees need to like you, okay? So, when we talk about liking a person, people who we admire, people who we look up to, we like them, right? We like them because when they listen, they learn, right? And we need that to be also done in the reverse. So in the leadership role, you want your people to like you, and the first thing is, you want them to listen to you to learn. So we're going to put this right here. Listen to learn. All right? The next thing is, we want to be able to inspire them. But why do we want to be able to inspire them? Because we want them to innovate. We want them to be creative. We want them to look at our processes, our procedures, our work culture. And you want them to be excited about sharing their ideas, about sharing their contributions and helping us ultimately to make the business better. So we want to inspire innovation. And what's the next thing we want to do? The next thing that we want to do is we want them to know to be kind, right? What's one of the easiest ways to create that working relationship that feels more like a work family relationship? It's to simply be kind to people. So we want them to know to be kind. And kindness costs us how much doesn't cost us a thing. And then the last thing we want, we want them to do more than just achieve their goals, right? We want them to, to crush those babies, right? We want them to absolutely own whatever performance metrics they're responsible for, right? So we want them to be excited to excel. People tend to do better at jobs. They tend to do better in workplaces that they're excited about, where they can be pumped and be amped up. So we want them to be excited, excited about coming to work, excited about making a positive difference, excited about meeting those goals. So this is why you want them to like you. You want them to listen, to learn from you. You want to inspire innovation from them. You want them to know to be kind and you want them to be excited to excel. All right, so I hope that that has helped someone. Please, please, please get in touch with me if you have any questions or if you need any additional tips or guidance, I'm always happy to help. And forgive my jeans. Right after this video, I'm going to do some work with the nonprofit today to serve some of the homeless people here in Baltimore. So I hope that you guys have an awesome day. Go out and do something great.